So here's another move that I see women doing a lot, both in sabar dance and in balach dancing in the clubs. It's um, very sensual, very suggestive, and it just involves a lot of hip motion, a lot of leg movement. So we're just going to work on the legs first. You're going to kind of be on the balls of your feet, and you want your knees moving in and out in a jutting, jutting in and out fashion, just like this. If you want to think, musicians, if you want to think, Musically, you can think one and two and three and four in a quarter note, eighth note kind of four, four meter. Or it can also go faster in more of a sixteenth note motion with the accent being on the outward. And that takes a little bit more practice. But if you start slow, kind of add a little bit you learn to add the hip thrusts in. You can expose as much of your midsection as you want. If you get more comfortable, you kind of learn to play with your clothes. And women usually like to put their hands here, kind of show off the hip thrusting motion side to side. You see this in a lot of Mbalak dance videos, which they call video clips in French. Side to side with a little bit of thrusting in there. So again, it can be in an eighth note, it can just be one and two and three and four, one and two and three and four, or it can be faster to go with the drum beat. So again, practice it slow, build your way up. As you build confidence, it depends on how much skin you want to expose women by lifting your shirt. You don't have to lift your shirt. It just depends on the kind of confidence you have as a dancer and what you want to portray to your audience.